Did you know that artificial sweeteners and those sweet zero-calorie drinks can also make you gain weight? Yes, that's possible. And we'll tell you how they can be bad for your health. Just like artificial sweeteners, there are many common foods you should never eat as they can destroy your health. For that, watch this video till the end. Let's begin. Number 1. Processed Meats Processed meats, like hot dogs, sausages, and deli meats go through industrial processing to make them last longer and taste better. During this process, many additives and preservatives are added to them, making them risky for your overall health. One common thing added to processed meats is sodium nitrite. It helps keep the meat's color and flavor and stops bacteria from growing. However, having too much sodium nitrite in your body can become a health concern. Some studies show that eating too much of it can increase the chances of getting certain types of cancer, like colorectal cancer. Another thing is that processed meats also often have artificial flavors, colors, and fillers. These extras make them taste good and look nice, but honestly, after the addition of these synthetic chemicals, the meat is unlikely to be as natural and organic as it should be. Plus, these synthetic chemicals can also mess with your health especially if your body is already sensitive to them. And lastly, processed meats often have a lot of sodium salts and unhealthy fats. Having too much sodium in your body can lead to high blood pressure and heart problems. Unhealthy fats, like saturated and trans fats, can also cause obesity, high triglyceride levels in the arteries, and heart disease if you have them too much. So instead of eating processed meat, go for healthier, more organic, and lean varieties of meat like 90-95% to lean beef, chicken breast, and turkey breast. Before we move on, please take a moment to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon. If you find our videos helpful, please support us by becoming a patron. Number 2. Fast Food Fast food includes those yummy burgers you can quickly get from drive throughs when you're in a hurry. But in fact, these juicy burgers often have some not-so-healthy stuff in them. One problem is that fast food burgers typically have a lot of unhealthy fats. Most of fast food manufacturers use fatty meat and cook it in oils that are high in unhealthy fats. Eating too much of these fats can make you more likely to have heart problems, get overweight, and have other health issues. Another issue is that fast food burgers and pizzas are usually loaded with sodium salts. Salt is often added to the meat, the sauces, and even the toppings. Having too much sodium can raise your blood pressure and make you more likely to have heart disease and strokes. And lastly, fast food burgers don't give you many of the good things your body needs, like fiber and many vitamins and minerals. They're also high in calories, which can make you gain weight. So if you are addicted to fast food, it could make you miss out on many essential nutrients and gain too much weight. Number 3. Breakfast Cereals Processed breakfast cereals are those tasty cereals that are often really sweet and come in many colorful varieties. One big problem with these processed and sugary breakfast cereals is that they have a lot of added sugar. But eating too much sugar can cause health issues like gaining too much weight, getting cavities in your teeth, and having a higher chance of getting conditions like type 2 diabetes and heart disease. Another thing is that these cereals often have artificial flavors, colors, and preservatives in them. That means they have more synthetic chemicals and a weak organic profile. Plus, after processing, these cereals are often stripped of their fiber content and many essential vitamins and minerals that your body needs. Instead, they mostly give you empty calories from sugar and refined grains that are not so good for you. Starting your day with these cereals might make you feel hungry sooner than enough, causing you to eat more and more. That can make you gain weight, which is not just bad for your physical appearance, but also a major risk factor for type 2 diabetes and heart disease. So it's best to never eat them and go for healthier, fiber-rich foods. For breakfast, oatmeal with blueberries and Greek yogurt is a very healthy option. Try it! Number 4. Margarine Margarine is a spread that many people use instead of butter. But did you know it goes through a process called hydrogenation? This process helps turn liquid vegetable oils into a solid margarine. Many manufacturers do this by heating up the oils and adding hydrogen gas, which changes their chemical structure. 
It makes the oils more stable and gives margarine a longer shelf life. But the problem is that hydrogenation can create something called trans fats. Trans fats are bad for our overall health and can lead to heart disease, high cholesterol levels, and inflammation in our bodies. Not all margarine products have trans fats, though. Many manufacturers have tried to reduce or remove trans fats from margarine because of health concerns. But it's still important to read the labels and check if the specific margarine you're considering has trans fats or not. Number 5. Non-organic fruits and vegetables Non-organic fruits and vegetables are often treated with pesticides. Pesticides are chemicals used to protect crops from bugs, diseases, and weeds. While pesticides help ensure we have enough food, that's what makes them more non-organic. Non-organic fruits and vegetables might have tiny traces of pesticides left on them, even after washing. Some studies suggest that long-term exposure to these pesticide residues, even in small amounts, is linked to health problems like hormonal imbalances, brain disorders, and certain types of cancers. Choosing organic fruits and vegetables is one way to reduce your exposure to pesticide residues. Organic farmers usually don't use synthetic pesticides. Instead, they focus on natural ways to protect their crops. They use organic fertilizers, pest control methods, and techniques that take care of the soil and the environment. Number 6. Deep Fried Foods Deep fried foods may seem really tasty, but they can have some negative effects on your health. Learning about the unhealthy fats they contain might make you think twice before eating them. One big problem with deep fried foods is that they soak up a lot of oil or fat when they're cooked. This not only makes them all greasy but also loads them of high calories and unhealthy fats. Not just that, but the oils used for deep frying often have unhealthy fats like saturated and trans fats. Eating too much of these unhealthy fats can lead to problems like high triglyceride levels in the blood, heart disease, and obesity. They can raise the levels of bad cholesterol in our bodies, which can clog our arteries and cause heart problems. Also, when foods are deep fried at high temperatures, they can form harmful substances, such as acrylamides and advanced glycation end products. These chemicals have been linked to inflammation, oxidative stress, and a high risk of developing cancer. Number 7. Artificial Sweeteners Artificial sweeteners are used instead of sugar in many foods and drinks. However, the potential risks of artificial sweeteners will make you think twice about using them. One of these concerns is their impact on weight. Even though artificial sweeteners have fewer calories, they may not actually help with weight loss and could even make you gain weight. This is because they are much sweeter than sugar and can make you crave more sweet foods, leading to overeating. Not just that, but artificial sweeteners can also affect blood sugar regulation. Even though they're chemically different from sugar, they can still trigger the release of insulin, which can affect how your body controls blood sugar levels. Regularly consuming artificial sweeteners can also change your taste preferences. You might start to prefer very sweet flavors and find it harder to enjoy the natural sweetness of fruits and healthy foods. This can make it difficult to have a balanced diet with a variety of nutritious options. To avoid all of that, try to opt for healthier and natural sweeteners such as stevia, monk fruit syrup, and honey in moderate amounts. Also, try to enjoy yourselves with naturally sweet but healthy foods like whole fruits, certain vegetables with a sweet taste like tomatoes, beets, green peas, carrots, and plant-based milk like coconut milk. Thank you for watching and subscribing to the channel. See you in the next video.